In a quiet village, Mr. Thompson, an elderly watchmaker, was known for his exceptional craftsmanship. He worked alone for years until one day, a young apprentice named Jake arrived at his shop. Jake was enthusiastic but green. How can you help me, Jake? You're just a boy, Mr. Thompson said skeptically. I may be young, but I learn fast, Jake replied with a confident smile. For weeks, Jake observed Mr. Thompson meticulously adjusting tiny gears and springs. One afternoon, while working on the mayor's prized watch, Mr. Thompson's hands began to tremble. Jake, my boy, I need to rest. Can you finish this? He asked, worry etched on his face. Jake felt a wave of anxiety but nodded. He took over, carefully following the old man's techniques. Just as Jake completed the final adjustment, the mayor walked in. Is my watch ready? He asked. Jake handed it over, holding his breath as the mayor inspected it. Perfect as always, the mayor said, handing Mr. Grawl Thompson a generous payment. Jake sighed in relief, and Mr. Thompson beamed with pride. Days turned into months, and Jake's skills grew. One day, a stranger entered the shop with a broken pocket watch. This watch is very dear to me. Can you fix it? The man asked. Mr. Thompson, feeling unwell, instructed Jake to handle it. Jake worked tirelessly, and after hours of effort, the watch was ticking perfectly. The stranger was ecstatic and offered Jake a substantial reward. You saved my most precious possession, he said. As the stranger left, Mr. Thompson placed a hand on Jake's shoulder. You've become a true watchmaker, Jake. You didn't just learn the craft, you embraced it. Jake smiled, realizing that the old watchmaker had given him more than just skills. He had given him trust and confidence. The moral? Skill can be taught, but trust and confidence must be earned. Embrace opportunities to grow, and you might find unexpected rewards.